You just got to man up a little bit. Why don't you man up about killing and eating dogs? Don't you come near me. We're out here, London, Leicester Square, out in front of Burger King. We've got a sign here. I'm going to go deep cover, undercover, meat eater, but a different kind of meat, actually. Hope I don't get beaten up for this. I'm going to get potatoes thrown at me. All right, here we go. You think it's weird? That's not very nice. You think it's weird to eat dogs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, man. Hey, take hey, this, man. Hello. Uh, how you going, bro? What's your name? Mitch, nice to meet you. Nice to meet Mitch. Yeah, I think it's weird. I just think it's weird because it's just man's best friend. Well, they're not my best friend, so it doesn't really matter to me, does it? Oh. If they're your best friend, don't eat them. If they're not your best friend, fair game? Oh, it's weird. I don't know. I feel it's just like, it's all sort of common sense in a way. The reason I think it's okay to eat dogs is because yeah. We've been doing it for thousands of years in many parts of the world. Yeah. Right? Dogs are not human, so who gives a about them, really? If they're not human, who cares? Uh, they're not as smart as us, so who cares? They're made of meat. Yeah. Why are they made of meat if they're not supposed I feel to be like, eaten? I feel like dogs are more of an animal of purpose, though. Like, if you're eating a pig, a pig doesn't really do much apart from what can a pig do unless you eat it. A dog, it can do many different things. Like, you know it, can go to, it, can, it can sniff things out. It can do... Pigs sniff things out? Yeah, but it's not as practical. Pigs have a better sense of smell than dogs. Yeah, but you're going to take a pig to chase a bad man down on the road. Do you know what I mean? Like uh, police, police dogs, dogs have a lot more purpose than. They've been trained to do that. They don't just do it willing. Yeah, have you seen you a think chihuahua? Gonna, do you think they're going to chase gonna, anyone? You're going to train a pig to chase down bad guys and stuff like that. So if a dog can't chase down a bad guy, I've seen some pretty funny dogs. They just sit there like. Yeah, I know, like chihuahuas. So they're they're, shit. they're okay. Yeah, to eat. They're okay to eat. I don't know. If they're say. not a good guard dog, is it okay to, for me to put them on the barbecue? Yeah, probably. Yeah. But not like, no. no, 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 it's not good because, like, they're emotional support animals as well, even the little ones. And if they're not? They all are. Come on. No, 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 no. They if all they, if they How not... could a dog not be? Because maybe they're just a bit smelly and they're not really that emotionally supportive. Really? Hypothetically, if there was a dog that wasn't a good emotional support animal, right. say they're very annoying and very, they cause a lot of anxiety to the person, yeah. is it okay yeah, to... Yeah, just free home. Is it okay to eat them? Well, in, in any situation, it's okay to eat any animal if it's edible, but it doesn't... In doesn't any situation, it's, it's okay to eat they're any not, animal uh, this if mean, they're edible. When you interview these people, they look at, like, you the word for word. It's so weird. The... <laughs> <laughs> no, I think... I think you know, you're... we are actually yeah. animals, human beings. Yeah, but in... in so it's okay to eat survival, that... yeah. You said in any situation... No, no, I didn't mean that. Okay, okay. That. I won't quote you on that. We'll yeah, we'll don't quote back. Just go back. In survival situations, it's okay to eat any animal? Yeah. Do if you, you saw a dog on a in a desert island and you, okay. Okay. And you okay. could okay. eat it. All right, all right. What animals do you eat? Everything, mate. But not dogs. Yeah. So what you mean everything like five animals, like a lamb, a pig, a chicken, the same yeah. five animals everyone. I just don't feel like the animal has much of a purpose I'm... apart from being eaten. And why do you so... eat those animals? Are you in a survival situation? No. But they don't have as much purpose as a dog. That's why that's that's just my mindset. And if the dog doesn't have a purpose, it's okay to eat the dog? The purpose you... I don't think I, I, I... What situation would a dog not have a purpose? I mean, just a dog that's... Their purpose is to exist. I mean, is it okay to eat that dog? You can give a dog anything. Oh, well, I can give a pig a purpose but if I just, want. It's normal, it's... If I give a chicken a purpose, right? Me, yeah. I give the chicken a purpose. Does that no, mean that you're not allowed to eat them? No. You you're not allowed to eat them then? No. If you raised a chicken from young and it's your pet, you wouldn't eat it. Do you know what I mean? I mean, a purpose. I just give them a purpose. Their purpose, it makes me happy that they're not being killed. Yeah. I'm, I'm talking, like, in the grand scheme of things. If you were just, like... <laughs> I don't know, like, if, it, if, you're gonna, if you're raising these dogs nicely, but I think most of these dog stuff, they're like, if you see in Korea and stuff, they're abusing them, and I think there's a lot of things like... If I don't abuse the dog, it's okay to kill them, eat them. <laughs> you eat animals that are abused all the time, you eat normal... I think, I think it just comes down to morally, and with, with any argument, it's like, there's no... There, there's not really any morals, unless you're religious. There's so there's no... no morals don't exist? It, 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 if unless you're religious, there's no. I wouldn't really bite a bullet on that, mate. Go, I go wouldn't, but I'd, I'd walk that back. What, what do you mean? Are there things that you wouldn't do because morals would hold you back? Yeah. Morals would stop like you from doing like eating a dog. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you said no morals. Ex morals don't I'm exist. Saying, I'm saying you I, have. I meant if you have the point of no morals exist, then you can just literally pick saying this. Yeah. This is not bad. This yeah. Is but not I'm bad. just asking you right now, like what your position is, because you obviously eat animals like all these yeah, other animals, yeah, yeah, yeah. and they are often tortured, you know that, right? Really? Yeah, well, factory farm, they torture animals, they put them in slaughterhouses, yeah, they're well, terrified, they don't that. want to die, and then you, you eat them. Yeah. So what's the difference between what you do and what I want to do? I'm just saying, I think, personally, morally, it's wrong. But then, is it also wrong to do that to those other animals? No, you shouldn't torture any animal. Okay. Yeah. Only by, like, organic, free-range stuff, anyway. They all go to the same slaughterhouse. 
Yeah, but they, they live... How do you know how they live? Do, do you go to the farm? No. But I actually investigate unless farms. Lying, unless of course they're lying to you. Are you vegan? Huh? Wait, so are you, are you... What are you? Are you vegan or are you...? I am a vegan trying to get people to think about the animals they eat. Okay. By choosing an animal they don't want to eat and calling them a hypocrite and asking them to think logically about the animals they do eat. Because through a cow's eyes and a pig's eyes and a lamb's eyes, they are no different in the way they suffer and want to live than a dog. Yeah, but they haven't really got much purpose apart from the way we've got our society is dogs have a purpose. You have no purpose for me, so it's okay for me to kill you? Yeah, but I have purpose. Yeah. What, what's your purpose? Well, my purpose within myself, so... Well, a pig's got a purpose within themselves too. They want to do their thing for the rest of their day. Yeah. You know, it okay. might not be a big purpose for you, but maybe your purpose... Yeah, but you is... could... That's when you sort of bring in, like, like a subconscious, almost. Like, a dog's going to have a lot more subconscious than evidence. You need evidence for that. No, a, dog, a pig's... Really? ...better in many uh, studies to do with intelligence and dogs. I'm talking about sentience, yeah. not smart, like... Yeah. Okay. You know what sentience is? Like, consciousness? Yeah. It's not smart. It's, it's like just, their experience. Just how they are... Yeah, like how they experience the world, okay. right? Like, you know, like, if you hit them, it hurts them. They uh, uh, get scared. Just like emotions and consciousness. It's almost sight. how close they are to us, in a way. Yeah. Okay. So all those animals have sentience. It yeah. doesn't matter which one's smarter or not. You shouldn't want any of them to be tortured and killed. But is your argument more just turn vegan? Because that's a whole other... Well, noise. when you buy the meat from the shop, what are you doing? You're paying someone to do that to the animal in order to get the meat, right? But would you kill an animal if you put it down humanely with a gun or something like that? Not to eat them. Why would I kill an animal to eat them? But I don't need to. This is life. But I don't need, I don't need to. I could eat something else. I've been eating something else for 10 years. Yeah, but you could argue it's not as healthy and you can go back and forth, but he's, he's not going to want it, it, Evidence? to eat meat, really. Like. Why, why do you think it's healthy? Natural proteins and stuff like that. Oh, God, my arm's bigger than really yours. Right. Put, put really your arm next to mine, come on. No, I've been vegan for 10 years. Yeah, Come on. You hit the gym all the time. I'm a tennis player. But you said there's no protein. I'm not going to have as big you said as there's no, 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 you, you said there's no protein. I didn't yeah, say there's okay. no protein. If you went to try and build muscle with someone one year, you and one person that ate meat. Come on. Dude, but you need different. to run a study. There are studies on this, you know that. So how many... They have actually done these kinds of studies. How many world's strongest men were... And it wouldn't matter if one was less strong by this much. Okay. It would, you're killing an animal. You have to justify it somehow. You can't say, oh, you'd be a little bit more strong yeah, if you did weights. Come on, man. Anyway, there are studies that prove that, you know, right. they're, they're about equal in terms of muscle growth. Yeah, Plant-based people and uh, meat eaters. But I feel like but everything's justifiable, though. Everything. It's not. It's not, man. It's not. No, I don't think not, not everything's justifiable, but everyone has a point to everything. And at the end of the day, like... OK, let me ask you this. How do you feel you've done in this discussion? I, I don't oh, I don't know as much as you, so I wouldn't say I would want a loss. I'm just trying to get... No, how do you I feel think, about... How, I, do, I came into this open-minded, so I'll yeah, just have. take it. I, I appreciate you standing you, here and talking to me. Yeah. Like, you've been a very good sport. Thank you. You haven't got pissed off enough, and you've, oh, you've been you, pretty good. But how do you feel about the way, you, like, your position? Do you feel it's consistent? No, there's definitely things that I'd have to sort of do it around. So I mean, I'm thinking on the spot a little bit, and I'm yeah. backtracking a little, a little like, on some stuff, for sure. But, like, I just... I, I don't know. I, I, I just don't think you should eat dogs, and I don't think like I'm not gonna have a point. I agree with you. This and I, that. Okay, I agree with you. I don't think you should eat dogs either. Yeah. I don't think you should eat cows though. Do you agree with that? No. I think. Well, you why should. not? And why not? That's where we. That's where we part ways. You don't have a really good reason yeah. to eat cows. At the cows. end of the day, you shouldn't kill anything. Anyone. Just, yeah. just do it. Anyone. Yeah. Anyone. There's someone in, the, yeah. in a cow. Like there's someone in a dog. Yeah, but it's, it's just moral, really. Like, yeah, it's just the way we've lived for hundreds of years. And... Okay. If you were in the cow's position, would your justifications, your excuses, be good enough to kill you? Would they be good enough in your eyes? I think life's life, really. You just got to get on with it. If, if something that you can't do nothing about it. So, like, basically, what you're saying in order to justify killing the cow? It's not really justification. It's just I don't want to be eating leaves and stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? Uh, I guess you could say it's selfish in a way. So you don't, you can't really justify killing the cow. I, li I just like the meat. That's you just like eating the meat, yeah. yeah. And it, I think why, why it's got nutritional what? values. You know what I mean? Like I know you can get stuff in vegan stuff as well, but yeah, exactly. It's just why it tastes vegan stuff tastes disgusting. It doesn't. It does. Okay. And if a vegan burger tastes disgusting to me, is it okay to kill you to eat you? You can try. No, no, no. I'm saying is it okay morally? I wouldn't try to kill you. It's a hypothetical, I'm just asking. The fact that you don't like the taste of a certain food group, even though there's like thousands of vegan foods. I just want to eat it. I'm trying to figure out if you think taste, like the sensation of taste, justifies killing a being over. Yeah. It does? Yeah, we're, we're, the, we're the highest on the food chain, do you know what I mean? We've got we've got a right and what we can do. We sort of in, we've evolved into our sort of what we can do and can't do, really, in my opinion. So if we're the strongest species, we're allowed to do what we want to any other species, even dogs? Yeah. So I can eat a dog? I don't agree with that. Yeah, but it's just... Morally. That's a contradiction. Just... You know that, right? 
Yeah, but it's not you really. You can't it's say we're the sense. supreme like, species. You can eat what you want. Except for dogs. They're like, <laughs> don't touch them dogs. That's just common sense. Nah, yeah, nah. It's just common sense. Nah, like, brother, it's not common sense. It it's it's your, you're picking and choosing. That's what you're doing. Right. You're picking and choosing, brother. Right. You've got a massive contradiction there. You can't justify eating other animals unless you can justify eating dogs, which I can't. I don't think it's right. It's either eat them all, you can't pick and choose. So what, what do you think about eggs? They torture the hens and they slaughter them in a slaughterhouse once they're done exploiting them for 18 months. Okay. Their existence is torture. They're pushing out an egg a day. It them up really badly. And yeah, horrific. The egg industry is horrific. So the sign is basically to try and find a contradiction from the start, yeah. basically. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But... You just come back to it. Yeah. Is it all right for her to eat you? Well, so come and talk to me about so it. Is it all right for her to eat you, though? I don't need to talk to you. You're a prick. If I'm flopping out, smack you off that chair. If you f smack me in the head, mate, it'll be f over for you. You understand me? You need to calm the down. No, you need to take that side. No, I'm having a discussion with people. Read on the signs that that's not a discussion. I'm having a discussion with people, alright? Read on the signs that that's not a discussion, is there? Do you eat animals? What? Do you eat animals? Right, I don't Do you eat, eat cows? Do I eat dogs? Do you eat cows? That's been domesticated for thousands of years. So have cows? No, they haven't been domesticated. Yes, they have. No, they're not. They're not Farm animals are domesticated by definition. No, yes, they are. No, they're not. So you can eat you're cows. Eat you can eat you're cows. Eat you can eat pigs. Yeah. You can eat ch uh, chickens. Yeah. You, you f dare. I, I dare do. you to f assault me. Yeah. Yeah. I dare you to, mate. Yeah? Yeah. Is that from the other way? No, no that's not self-defense. No, don't you don't come near me. Don't, don't come near me, mate. Come the other way, or what? Don't come near me because what? I'll, I'll defend myself. Or what? I'll defend myself. You're threatening me, dude. I'm having a discussion with people. You're threatening me. No, that's not a discussion. Read the f sign. You eat cows. Read your sign. That's you eat cows. That's you, you've got cameras everywhere here, dude. What? I'm having a discussion. You're threatening me. You sound like you're going to punch me in the head. I'm not going to stand there while you punch me in the head. You're threatening me, bro. There's cameras everywhere, dude. Are you going to go to jail over a sign? Think yeah. about it. You're going to go to jail over a sign. Who's going to look after your dog? Who's going to look after your dog? Listen to me. Let me tell you what I'm doing. Do you want, do you want to know what I'm doing? I don't eat any animals or dogs. I'm getting people. I'm getting people to who eat meat. What did you say, sir? It says it's okay to eat dogs. You know what I'm doing? I'm getting people who eat other animals to think about the animals they do eat. Because no, no. Let, let me finish. Let me finish. Let me. Uh, no, don't get pissed off, mate. What? Don't get pissed off. Why do you keep being threatening? Just calm down. Who cares? You eat, you eat cows. No, you're about to punch me in the head over a sign. Why don't you come and talk to me instead of being threatening? Would have been much better. So, sorry? They all eat animals too. I'm getting people to think about it. Sorry? I'm getting people to think about the animals they eat, yeah. Is that not a natural is that not protein? What did you say? Say it again? There's no difference between a or a cow. Exactly. Exactly. Are you a vegan? An animal is a source of protein. Are you a vegan? You're not saying that, mate. You're not saying that. No, it's making a point here. You're going to eat a chicken or a cow, mate. You might as well eat a dog. No, but they're pets. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. A cow's not a pet. Before I got angry. What I'm saying is that if you can if you can justify putting cows in slaughterhouses, right? Pigs into gas chambers, CO2 gas chambers, chickens into egg farms where they're getting they're literally being tortured, pushing out eggs, and then they get slaughtered, get sold in KFC, and people get pissed off with a dog being eaten. I'm saying they're picking and choosing. All those animals deserve to live with protection, free from suffering, right? And we shouldn't be picking and choosing. We should be having a consistent moral framework for all sentient animals. That's my point. Do you not feel like the, that message is not clear enough to what you're saying? No, it is perfect because dogs are sentient beings, right? Yeah. What happens to a dog matters to a dog. It's wrong to kill a dog and eat them. Oh, it's wrong to kill a dog and eat them. What happens to a cow matters to a cow. What happens to a chicken, if I stomp on a chicken, that hurt the chicken, it's wrong. To the chicken, it's wrong. Not, I don't care what people what think, people think. What the ch to the bird, it hurts them, right? Yeah. So my argument is, if it's wrong to do it to a dog, it's also wrong to do it to these other animals. I'm just doing it, I'm doing it undercover. I'm trying to get people to come to me. So you're trying to make them think? Make them think. You understand, brother, you understand. Is he your mate? Are you friends? Are you together? <laughs>
<laughs> but thank you for stopping and chatting. No, no, yeah. You good? No, I just had something, but I just... Come on, come on then. Okay, no, I was just, I was just thinking, I was just coming back. I was like, I was thinking, oh, I'm going to say, at the end of the day, you just got to man up a little bit. I'm not, I'm not saying the man, but I was like, oh, he's going to say, what's a man? Do you know what I mean? No, so, what? So, no, because I was going to say, like, I think when it comes to not eating dogs and eating other animals. You're think, saying man up, as in, like, yeah, you got to, like, not, have a bit, more, thick, a a bit just... more of a thick skin. Yeah. But why yeah. don't you man up about killing and eating dogs? I just think morally, it's just, <laughs> morally it's wrong, because they just, they've, nah, been, bro. They've, been, they've been, like, yeah. I don't even know the word, but like that man said, domesticated. For, we've been using them for our self advantage. Wild animals are also domesticated. Yeah, but we've used them to our advantage for self gain. So in a way, we're sort of repaying that that's, by not that's eating. That's not why it's wrong to kill a dog. It's yeah, wrong to kill a dog using, because the dog doesn't want yeah, to die. But we've been using a dog for self gain, and that's helped us out with stuff we want to do. So we're repaying it by not eating it. It's a selfish, self centered reason to not do something horrible to an animal. Well, no, it's not selfish because we're not eating them now. That's that's what I'll no, way of repaying them. You're saying us. because they provide that's some kind of they they did something for us, therefore we're going to let them be. But these other animals, cow doesn't really do nothing for me except I want to shoot him in the head and eat him. Exactly. So therefore it's okay to do yeah. that. So basically humans dictate what it's what's okay and not okay to do to whatever animal they want. Yeah. And you're okay with that? Yeah. We we run we run the world. Do you know what I mean? I think I think you've got to have. You don't some run the world. No humans. You don't the run the world. The species does. The species does. You don't run the world. <laughs> There are, there are a lot of people that could have that view of you. Yeah, And exactly. a lot of strong, scary people every, in this world. Every there are people like that guy there, life. if he, I mean, I don't know, like, if he was bigger and he could, like, I don't know, if he exactly. was a bad Is person, that, exactly. there are bad that's, people out there exactly. who take people exactly. and do and what you you're saying about it. Yeah. to humans. Exactly. And that's, you is that okay? No, Is that okay? okay? It's not okay. Uh, okay, that's so you don't support it when it's done to humans. Is it, wait. You don't support a stronger, So if someone was to beat you up and just because they're... Are you saying... You called us a superior species, right? Yeah. And you said, therefore, it it's okay because we're superior. Right. No, it, it doesn't, because yeah. a big guy could come beat you up because you're stronger. And, and, and doesn't so Mike right. doesn't... So basically, it's called Mike Makes Right. You know, if you're bigger and stronger than someone else, anything that you do doesn't it's matter. So it's okay it's, to no, do... No, no, you, no, no, yeah. no. It's so hard to argue with. I, think, I just think it's common sense, but... It's not common sense. Yeah, it's your it's conditioning, bro. Huh? It's your conditioning. Conditioning. Over time, you are conditioned through culture yeah. to say, this dog here, uh, these animals we don't eat, and these animals we do eat. It's yeah. all programming conditioning. That's so what it is. I know you probably get asked this all the time, but in a survival situation, would you kill an animal? In self-defense for like someone trying to attack my family, yeah, I would kill them. I'm not saying that's wrong, but I'm saying yeah. if there was- So if it wouldn't was... be, even if it was a human, I would probably do that. But I'm saying you know if there I mean? was a wounded animal right in front of you, whatever animal, and it can, it wasn't, it was, okay, what, what do you think about putting an animal out of its misery then? The only humane slaughter, in my opinion, yeah. is if the animal is suffering and to keep them alive is more cruel than to help them die. Okay. So basically, euthanasia. But, but it's a life, like you said. So, yeah, uh, but, but, but if they can't be helped, right? Yeah. If they're suffering so much that they can't be helped, then it's more humane to kill them at that point. And if you didn't eat it? I wouldn't eat them. I wouldn't no. eat them, like. So what do you think about I would the horse? Probably bury them. They, you know. But do you think would you eat? Yeah, but if a dog had a, like two broken legs, they snap, doesn't work, and you wouldn't eat that. That's a waste of the dog. Do you not think? Complete waste of the no, dog. I just wouldn't eat them out of respect, and I could eat something else. It's just disgusting to eat a corpse. Everything's a corpse once you kill it. Not a carrot or a bit of rice or something. Yeah, but. That doesn't make any sense because if you have an injured animal that's it's going to die and you can't do anything with it, then it, what's wrong with eating it? Well, there's nothing really wrong with just eating an uh, animal that's died naturally. Yeah. But, I, but you asked me if I would. No, not naturally. You wouldn't want to kill. You want to eat anything that's died naturally. But I'm saying if you had to put something down that was completely healthy. Yeah. But look at the horses. Ones with a horse had a broken leg. You think you shouldn't eat that? I don't think you should put them down just for a broken leg. I mean, that's a complex, nuanced discussion about okay, like I whether thought, or not it's justified I, I to that, kill a horse. I thought you couldn't do. It. I thought you had to put them down. But that's my. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. They put them down because it's not economically viable to keep them in the industry racing or whatever they're using the horse oh, for. They, can they, can they yeah. Have, can actually repair. Sorry? It can actually repair themselves. I didn't know that. They'd rather not use vet bills on them and they just kill them. So, oh, wow. Yeah. But, yeah. But, yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's fair enough. Yeah. yeah. It's good talking to you, bro. Yeah, nice to meet you. I mean, oh, what's your... Joey Carbstrong. You're a good dude, man, eh? I just hope you... Be consistent. All right, thank you very much. See you, mate.